this, Andy. Hey, that's a nice boat. Oh yes, you know it has a hundred coins. Wow, Sandy! I'll show it to the craft teacher. She asked us to make a boat. Remember? Yes, I remember. So, have you made a boat too? Yes. Oh really? <laughs> Why are you laughing? Because I know you must have made a paper boat. So, what will happen when the teacher compares your boat to mine? My boat is made of coins. It looks like a boat of a prince, and your boat will look like a poor man's boat. <laughs> your boat is really beautiful, but you shouldn't make fun of my boat either. Why shouldn't I? What is so special about your boat? Wait, I'll show you. Come here if you want to see. I don't like my boat. It will not float. Why you? <laughs> hey Sandy, you're crying. What is the matter? Wow, such a nice boat. It is not a nice boat. It can't float on water, like peaks. Well. You behaved like the peacock, Sandy. The peacock? Yes, the one who insulted the crane. The crane? Yes, Granny, the crane. Oh, are you? Please tell us the whole story. Well, all right then. One day. For you. Oh, I'm fine. You know, I think it's going to rain. You want to dance with me? Dance? Uh, no. Actually, I have to go. Don't give me an excuse. I know you cannot dance. You are a poor bird. You are a poor bird. Fine. You know, I think it's going to rain. You want to dance with me? Dance? Uh, no. Actually, I have to go. <laughs> Don't give me an excuse. I know you cannot dance. You are a poor bird. What do you mean? You are a poor bird, aren't you? You don't have a bit of a color on your wings. Look at me. I'm robed like a king in gold and purple and all the colors of a rainbow. Just look at me. I am purely majestic. You have fine feathers, but you shouldn't make fun of others this way. Don't preach me, you poor fellow. What do you have? I can soar to the heights of heaven. And lift my voice to the stars, while you walk below like a cock among the birds of the dunghill. You see, fine feathers don't alone make fine birds. Bye bye.
So, you see, one shouldn't boast about themselves and criticize others. After all, fine feathers alone don't make fine birds. That was a wonderful story, Vayu, and I have learned my lesson too. I was wrong when I made fun of Pete. I'm sorry, Vayu. You are a sweet boy, Sandy. Remember, God has made us all very special. He's given each one of us a quality that is unique. So never compare and never make fun of others. I will always remember Vayu. Thank you, Vayu. You're always welcome, Sandy. Now it's time to say goodbye. We'll meet again soon. Bye, bye, Vayu. Bye, bye, Sandy.